rules. In fact, not two rules, but two factors, two pillars that what my mentor taught me. This specific mentor by the name of Mark, he probably makes on average a few hundred thousand US dollars a month and uh, he mentored me from as early as 18 years old and um, he taught me two factors, two pillars that just open up my mind and life to a whole different level. People always ask me, you know, how am I so focused at such a young age? Like I was focused since I've been eight years old and now I'm 24 years old, 16 years of personal growth, personal development, but so focused on it. And um, you know, it's because of these two pillars. You know, the first pillar he taught me was, you know, there's three rules to life. Rule number one, okay, pay attention. Pay attention, meaning who are you paying attention to? Who are you listening to in life? You know, a lot of people get so distracted and sidetracked that they really and truly forget. They forget why they made that decision. They forget, you know, why they took that first step towards a desired result. And paying attention means get in your lane, man. Get so zoned in, so focused. You know, when a kid, um, you know, is about plus minus six years old and they're watching cartoons on TV, like you can bring anything you want. You can bring food to them. You can try to distract them. The only way you'll get their attention is by putting that TV off. And they're so focused, you gotta pay attention. Pay attention. So you're paying attention to broke people or you're paying attention to successful people? Are you paying attention to personal growth and personal development or are you paying attention to things that are you know, deteriorating your mind, killing you within you and most importantly taking you out the game? You know, paying attention is so vital. Get on your phone and stop you know, focusing on those notifications when a WhatsApp message comes through, a Telegram message comes through, a Facebook or Instagram or Snapchat notification, an app notification, it takes you off the rail. It literally creates some sort of a distraction. Eliminate all distractions now so you can have your desired result in a shorter period of time. Pay attention. He taught me that anything in life you do, you got to pay attention. If you can master the art of paying attention and staying in the zone and you know literally rule number one is going to correlate with the second pillar that I'm going to share with you, not the second rule, but the second pillar. In fact, this is three rules, three rules right now to life, okay? Three rules that he taught me, Mark, my mentor, making over you know, a few hundred thousand dollars. And you know what I was always taught in life? Find someone that has what you want from life. Do what they've done, say what they've said, and you can only get what they get in life. And um, you know, Mark was one of my five mentors that I had from eight years old till today. So Mark just came into my life when, about seven years ago when I was 18, but pay attention, stay in the zone. And you know, a lot of people are negotiating why they should have 10, 15, 20 streams of income, or even two. Like I would rather you make literally $100,000 from one stream of income, focused, zoned in, than trying to have $10,000 from 10 different streams of income. Get zoned in. Multiple streams of income is the way to become successful, but only when you master one, then move on to the next one. Only when you master a particular art in life, then go out there and start something different. Pay attention, stay zoned in. I see so many people losing traction, losing sight. They, you know what they say, if you chase the vision, you swim, but if you chase the money, you start to, sw you start to sink. And a lot of people are not paying attention. They're really and truly not zoned in. They're not aligned. So whatever you do, health, wealth, happiness, love, you know, whatever you do, whether you focus on your relationship, whether you focus on you know, your finances, whether you focus on spiritual, whether you focused on you know, you're just a, a simple thing like you know, the quality of life, just focus and most importantly, pay attention. Rule number two, okay, he taught me, get excited. Get excited meaning, you gotta stay in the zone, man. You gotta be pumped up, naturally pumped up. You know, a lot of people think I'm on this and I think I'm on that because they, that's what they on. I'm naturally high on life, no joke. I don't smoke, I don't do drugs, I don't do all that stuff, but most importantly, I'm naturally high on life. I'm excited. You know what they say? Get excited before the paycheck shows up. I was so pumped up about life when I was broke that it was so natural when I kind of made it, I was pumped up as well. Get excited. Energy is vital. You know what they say? Time is the biggest commodity in life, but life is the energy business. Everything you do in life 
tr literally translates in energy. The energy you're feeling right now, your, your conscious mind right now in the now is attracting the right type of things into your life. The universe only rewards people who deserve what they get. So get excited. I was very pumped up about my Ferrari way before I had the Ferrari. I was pumped up about the president's home before I even moved into it. I was pumped up about this lifestyle before I even lived it. You've got to, and all my videos, you, you hear the 80-20 principle. 80% of life is psychological, 20% is mechanics, but you hear it, get excited. You just got to get excited in life. And number three, he taught me never quit. Never quit, no matter what you do. You get in a relationship, never quit. You jump into school, never quit. You choose a hobby, never quit. You start a business, never quit. See, in life, to master anything is three years, a thousand days, five to six nights a week, all day, every day, get married to the game. When you, made, when you took that vow, when you literally put the ring on your significant other's finger, when you had a kid, you can't quit from that, man. You gotta get stuck in the game. Right now, stats say that there's more people getting divorced than ever before. More people right now literally quitting university than ever before. Most people right now committing suicide than ever before. We're living in a society where people believe in microwave success. Like putting the food in the microwave, 60 seconds gets heated up. Put your life in the microwave, 60 seconds, your entire you know, lifestyle you desired, you visualized, became a reality. It's not gonna happen. Life is not instant gratification. Life is delayed gratification. He taught me never ever quit in life. He taught me that no matter what you do, from day one, stay focused, have a clear, concise picture of the end in mind, know who you are, know where you're going, and know what you're gonna be, but never ever throw in the towel. There's only one, there's only one way you can, you can fail. Is by quitting. You can't get fired in life. I'm talking about, you know, you want to own your own company. You can't fire yourself. You can't fire yourself from a hobby. You are the boss, but you can't quit, man. You never, ever quit. So pay attention, get excited, never quit. And if you follow those three rules, like how I followed it for the six years of my seven years of business and 18, 16 years of personal growth and personal development. Well, everything in life, I've literally mastered these three rules. When I got into personal development, I paid attention. I got excited. I never ever quit the journey, no matter how much it costs me, no matter how much of time, no matter the delayed gratification. I got into my relationship uh, a few years ago with a, with a, with a girlfriend and um, you know, pay attention, get excited, never quit. I never ever quit. Once again, if you can cheat in a relationship, you can literally cheat on everything out there in life. Universe will reward those who deserve it. Just remember that. You get into a, a sport right now, you know, pay attention, get excited, never ever quit. You get into a business right now, pay attention, get excited, never ever quit. You get into gym right now, pay attention, get excited, never ever quit. Understand, brand new year, majority, 86% of people are literally quitting their resolutions 14 days into the year. Don't be a quitter. People don't think as your business as a scam. They don't think as your programs as a scam. They don't think as a hobby as a scam. They think of you as a scammer because you start and you never ever finish. How you start will determine how you finish. And then the second pillar he taught me about was um, something that's very powerful. Okay, the second factor, in fact, he taught me in life. You know, there's two points. There's a point A and there's a point B. How, now if you put two dots, because you're literally going out there and you want to get from A to B, what is the quickest way to get from A to B? Well, very simple, a straight line, a straight line. And he taught me in life what people generally do is they get onto the line and they get so distracted. So I followed these three rules, but then I stayed on the line. He says you, get, you, you literally start off brand new year, you get pumped up, go through a relationship, and you go off the line. You go back to a personal development seminar, you get plugged into trainings, you listen to audios, you get hyped up, you believe you can win, you get back onto the line. Okay? Then you go for a little run, literally, you jog it out, you sprint towards you know, a few days of success, you can't feel like you're making, now you're questioning and negotiating the results you're getting, so guess what you do? You're back on track, off track. You lose sight of the vision. And then you, you know, literally, you, you count your yourself out. I can't make it. I can't do it. Subconscious mind. 
programming, habits, taking you out the game. Eventually what starts to happen, you get pumped up because you meet someone who is so motivated, or you date her or him for a little while, you stay on the line, once again, break up, you're off the, off the line again, you're off track. And this right here is not the rules of success. This is not pay attention, get excited, never quit. This is not gonna get you to the desired result. If you really and truly wanna genuinely win, you need to start from A and you need to stay on the line and you go literally to B. Now is it natural to get off the line? Yes. Is it natural to think negative? Yes. Is it natural right now to go out there and have that inner voice trying to count you out the game? Yes. Is it natural for people's opinions to come in? Is it natural for you to question your journey? Yes. All of that stuff is natural but realistically speaking I need you to understand something. It is also natural for you to win. There's winners out there. I'm giving you full permission to win right now. Stop negotiating on why the journey from A to B is not your journey. People are winning right now. Tell me how Bill Gates became one of the wealthiest people around the world. Tell me how Jeff Bezos started off Amazon. Tell me how Stephen Jobs started off Apple. Tell me how Warren Buffett started off Berkshire Hathaway. Tell me how the wealthiest people in the world stayed on the line and you're not qualified to stay on the line. Keep selling yourself on why you are not qualified and I'll keep selling the fact on you deserve to win. Trust me, follow these three rules in life and go from A to B. Find a mentor. I was introduced to mentorship. The word mentor, first time I ever heard it was when I was eight years old. Find someone who has what you want, do what they've done, say what they've get, said, walk like they walk, talk like they talk, eat like they eat, literally, and you get what they get. And so what I did, I mastered and articulated their actions by emulating someone who had what I want from life. They say if you have nine broke friends, there's one guarantee, you're number 10. If you have nine successful friends, good possibility of you being number 10. I'd rather have two friends who lift me up than pull me down, rather than have 10 people around me and they're all fake, they're foes. So pay attention, get excited, never quit. A to B, this is a brand new year, this is your year were you qualified to allow yourself to win? So if you love what you see right now, do me a favor, below, tag someone who deserves to hear this, or go out and share this with your friends and family. Hop onto my YouTube channel, Sashin Govinder, the millionaire student, um, and you know, I'm just gonna coach you and mentor you. I'm your virtual, virtual mentor. Wherever you go, you can take me with. So I had five mentors in life, one of them was virtual, youtube.com. YouTube was never picking up the phone and saying, Sashin, did you watch a video today? Sashin, did you execute on your ideas today? Sashin, did you learn today? That's what a mentor is. So A to B, you're here, stay on the line, stay focused, stay aligned with the vision, and I'll see you on my next video.